Elements in an extensive food stamp fraud scheme we first told you about in June. Yeah, it was the case where dozens of people were arrested, accused of giving up their benefits in exchange for cold hard cash. Officers have now arrested the accused ringleader's brother. 12 News investigator Lauren Hensley explains why. Erica and Kevin, a two brother team. That's how District Attorney Bob Wortham describes this food fraud scheme. Here are the brothers' mugshots. DA Wortham says Johnny Coleman is considered the mastermind and racked up $71,000 in benefits. The DA says Larry Coleman's role in the plot was to convince people to turn over their benefits in exchange for cold hard cash. The DA says this binder in front of him contains extensive interviews, 27 confessions, and video evidence from the case. Prosecutors say Johnny Coleman offered 50 cents for every dollar worth of SNAP benefits. They claim he used the benefits to purchase goods and food for his restaurant off of Highland Avenue in Beaumont. 60 plus people are facing charges and that number could grow. We could, absolutely. It's, their investigation is not over. So if you're thinking about selling your food stamps, you might give a long, hard thought about who you're selling them to or even doing it because um, you too could be arrested. Wortham says this is just the first round of felony charges filed. He says they plan to review the case again and see if there are smaller offenders that would qualify for misdemeanor charges. If you're interested in seeing who's already been charged in the scheme, head to our website 12newsnow.com. Lauren Hensley, 12 News Investigates. Thank you, Lauren.